action. My warmest greetings to you all. I'm called Godwin Odejebi. I work with the Ghana Statistical Service and my position is an assistant chief statistician and I like demography and for that matter issues relating to fertility. I'm going to talk to you about the fertility behavior of women and girls aged 12 years and older. This section seeks to find out the total number of children both male and female those alive that is 12 years and older and their survival status it also collects information on the last births to women 12 to 54 years i will also speak to you to provide information on age of mothers age 12 years and older at the time of the birth of their first child born alive. This session will serve as a source of data for fertility indicators to monitor the growth of the population and also inform policy decisions. We are asking this question in the census to help determine the levels and the differentials of children ever born alive and their survivorship in the country. We say a live birth has occurred when after the child is born and they have cried, they have also breathed or show any other evidence of life such as beating heart, pulsation of the umbilical cord or voluntary movement of the muscles. In the birth to a child that did not show any sign of life, for example, if they were dead on arrival, should be considered as still birth and should not be considered as a live birth. As an enumerator, you are to recall the following information. When asking about children ever born alive to women 12 years and older, you should record the total number of children the woman has ever born alive by sex, that is, whether they are male or female. We also want you to know the number of children born alive to the woman and how many are living with her in the household as well as whether they are male or female. You should also recall the number of male or female children born alive to the woman who are living elsewhere. And finally, you should recall the number of children ever born alive who have since died, noting whether they were male or female. We are also asking about the last child born alive to women 12 to 54 years. We want to know the day, month, and year of birth of that last child born alive as well as their sex, age and survival status. These are sensitive questions, so please take your time and ask the questions carefully. In all situations, we should ask the questions to all females age 12 years and older directly. Like with all census sections, the answers will help create better data so policy makers can make better decisions that affect people's lives. Thank you.